elbows and knees. All right, again, deadly infighting tools capable of imparting tremendous damage to your opponent. <clears throat> I'm going to use Eric again. He's tight, in a shell, protected. When you, you deliver an elbow in pancration, what you're basically doing is you're slashing with the elbow. All right? It's like the hook where you're twisting the hips into the blow, but you're actually swinging the elbow out and downward. Out and downward. And both elbows can be used to the head. All right? So the right elbow, left elbow. You pivot off the ball of the foot just like in a hook. So in that sense, elbow blows are very similar to hooking blows. Um, hooks rarely go to the body. In pancreation, they're delivered primarily to the head. Now, the elbows can also be used downward. So let's say we're clinching the back of our opponent's neck and we pull him downward. We can actually use our elbow to strike him in the back of the neck or the top of the spine. So the elbow can be used in a downward fashion. And this is a very damaging technique. Let me review this again uh, without a partner. <clears throat> I'm facing my opponent in close with a tight guard. My hands are up protecting my head, so they're higher than normal. So I've readapted my stance, especially in my hand guard, to be um, able to stop blows to the head from this toe-to-toe -to -toe range. This is also known as the ram position because our heads are actually um, hitting one another, like two rams fighting. When you're in this close, it's the elbows, okay, that really impart some of the greatest damage. Um, again, here's the movement, a big twisting motion from the hips. Don't forget to swivel off the ball of the front foot. Drive the elbow, and remember, it's not a pushing blow, it's not a, a, a forearm. You're using the bony part of the elbow to do the damage. All right, so it's a quick twist and a slashing blow of the elbows to do the damage to the head. Now, just as effective as the elbows in close are your knees, okay? For knees to be most effective, you have to combine them with what we call in Greek, ama, or neck clinching. Thanks for watching our video lessons here at TRS Direct. Hit the like button down below and consider subscribing to our channel here on YouTube. Hit the bell icon and we'll send you a notification when there's a new lesson available. Thanks again for watching.